Lots of anticipation around the city today. It's Derby Day, but who's going to come out on top? We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. And a warm welcome to the Zignal Iduna Park. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Bochum. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Pulls it back. The danger not over. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Marcel Zabitzer plays alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And Niklas Füllkrug oh, is a score here, Derek. Still possibilities. And held by the keeper at the second time of asking. Well, he's just pulled off a great first save there. Now they can all calm down. Well, looking at Julian Brandt, a player who possesses pace and daring. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Both. The ball with Marco Reus. The supporters want to see him have a go. Can he open them up here? Cuts it back. Superbly read and executed. Asano. It's with Vitek. Losia. Takuma Asano. Good run, very much in control of the situation. Might go ahead. Closing down well. Oh, great defending. Emre Can. Here's Fulkrug. Royce. Well, oh, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Hoffman. And they need to get tighter. There's the cutback. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. No possibilities in the centre. Vital piece of last ditch defending. The referee's whistle, and so the first half has come to an end here at the Zignal Iduna Park. Well, an honest assessment, Stuart, would be that he hasn't really been on top of his game and attack. Well, as the touch map shows us, he hasn't posed much of a threat so far, and that's down to a couple of things. Yes, the service hasn't been great, but his movement hasn't been good enough today. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Brandt. Matos Bero Hoffman
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Opportunity to take the lead. Chance maybe. Making sure nothing came of it. Hoffman. Possession lost, intercepted. Philip Hoffman. Takuma Asano. Well, that's eye catching, wide play. Opportunity here. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Well, just listen to these Dortmund fans. They're demanding a winner here, and I wouldn't be surprised if they get it. Well, nothing to split the two sides, but this move looks promising. The cut back. Just the challenge that was required. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Marco Reus. He's got to score! And there it is! Dortmund strike first at the derby! They're pumping up the volume, and why not? Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Just ten minutes to go. And into an attacking position. It's not too late for them. And drawing it back. This could level it. Top class defending. Brandt. Now can they counter clinically? Wolf. This could finish it. Oh, magnificent reaction. The end of the game then, officially, and a victory for the Schwarz-Gelben. Their fans are going to be happy with this. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. Well, a spectacular contribution from Julian Brandt. It really was eye-catching. What did you make of his overall performance, Stuart? Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.